from the Daniel Lynch Gymnasium in Brooklyn Heights, Brooklyn, New York, USA. It's the St. Francis Brooklyn Terriers in NEC men's basketball action against the Sacred Heart University Pioneers. Give and go with Higgins back to Chauncey. Now Yaya back to Higgins. 10 to shoot. Yaya for three to tie it. It's good. Evans splashes one. Around the Mwenkat screen. Chauncey from downtown. There it goes. Chauncey drains it. And we're tied at 11. Mark, it doesn't surprise me. Yesterday, practice ended about 1 o'clock. I wound up walking out of this gym close to three. Who was still in the gym by himself shooting? Chauncey Hawkins. Aaron Clark got around Hawkins and took it to the hole. Layup by Rats was a little too strong. Flipped it over the rim. Nice pass from Chauncey to Trey. And Quarterbound hits from the baseline to put the Terriers back on top. Sweet shot right there. Didn't even hit the rim. That literally like just made it through the bottom of the net. Feathery touch. Well said. You know, the Terriers right now are trying to get their record, you know, back up to 500 with a win. There's Thomas from downtown, his second three. Not today, Pioneers. Man, they're fighting with each other. Yeah. Quarterbound <laughs> took a hop, no call. Here's Yaya from downtown, too strong. Atz in the rebound. Terriers have a second chance opportunity. Here's McLean down low, little lefty hooked. That rolls in for a unique. Johnson gave to Six Smith. Spokus comes out, Atson with a breakaway. And he flushes it. And the Terriers have their largest lead of the day at eight. Again of Quartelbaum, okay? He got that extra possession right there, found the open man, the ball kept moving like hot potato. Led to a high percentage shot. Clark splashes the baseline three to cut the lead to four. Three, he's in, Watson is out. Then you have Tyler Thomas, the conference's leading scorer, 22. Spokus is 23, and Dutrell wearing 30. And Chauncey goes to the left hand. <laughs> he gave him a little curly kneel there. Little globetrotters, went to the knees with the dribble, came back, shot with his off hand. What a good move. Crafty using some. Head and shoulder fakes to lift the Terriers off their feet. Atson around the Stevenich screen. Travis pulls up and he knocks down a tray. Atson's got a dozen. He's two for three from downtown. Continuing his hot shooting here in the second half, carrying over from the first. And this now the biggest lead at a dozen. Nice dish from Thomas to Dutrell. Back in Brooklyn Heights, a marquee slice. Terriers. Trying to build on a four-point lead. Trey for Trey. A big three. Extends the lead to seven, and Quartobaum has five. Well, that's more his game right there. Getting it, that one or two dribbles on the deck. Okay, squaring his shoulders up. Finishing at the rim. Thomas, who's been held in check, puts up a three over Unique and drains it as Latina calls timeout. Actually, 13-6. Sacred Heart with 13. Terriers have only six turnovers. And you remember, for much of the early part of this season, Coach, turnovers were a big-time problem. Mowencat showing some nifty footwork. 100 seconds away from their eighth conference win of the year. McLean breaks the press. Quartelbaum underneath. And he beats Spokus to the 10. Terriers up 15, their largest lead of the game as Rads will dribble it out at midcourt, and that will do it. Drive home safely, my friends, as the Terriers take this one and snap a three-game losing streak in the rivalry against Sacred Heart. St. Francis Brooklyn wins it 88.